in the words of in the words of a youtuber we all love and enjoy all, all, all love and enjoy out of this house out of this house spirit to be gone this from this house, house. <laughs> oh jeez uh. out of this house out of this house and speak of this design and what he does i have several questions okay safe now here we go <laughs> I actually got creep, creeped out from that. Yeah, I no, think I, I creeped out by my own self! I honestly forgot that was a thing that happened! Alright, grab it. Uh, grab that. Okay, that's two. One more to go. It's not on this one, which means it's probably over here. I think. Maybe? Possibly? Not too sure. Oh, uh, nope. Nope. Nope! Okay. Let's look a little further, because it wouldn't be that easy. Oh, uh, yeah, there it is. Nope. Nope. Back off. All right. So this is all about lowering it in this instance. While the other one was raising it, this is lowering it. What? Nope. Go away! Sheesh. I'm trying to turn valves here. Do you think you can give me a break? Apparently yeah. not. This is a horror game, after all. True. True. All right, that's two. Now for one more. So this is pretty much it. Just turn and cranks. And open the door. And that's the third cell. Well, I know how to get things done, little missy. No comment. Uh, Bendy! Keep <laughs> those comments to yourself. Also, back off! The nasty ink demon. Not you. I mean these little lurker things. I don't know, I know exactly which one you're talking about. Yeah, although I must say, I am kind of thankful that, you know, Joey hasn't made too many appearances. It certainly has made this a lot easier. Y you do know what's coming up next, though, right? Oh, right, the gauntlet. I no, always... not that. There was one more task, remember? Oh, right, but there was a gauntlet before that, if I recall correctly, which means you have to fight, like, the entire butcher gang and a couple of lurkers, so... There's still that to, you know, deal with. Look, the past is in the past. Why don't you just leave it there? Well, there are times where in the past that, you know, there were times where it was definitely simpler and that you just kind of want to go back just because you had good memories and you want to relive them. I agree with that, but sometimes it's better to let the past go and move forward because the future is so bright. That is very true. At the same time, I guess, I guess actually that would be considered a more tragic side of Susie of that is that she was so focused on what happened in the past that she wasn't able to really move forward and she kind of wants to bring him back, but she doesn't know how, so she's stuck in this loop of wanting to li relive the good days, but can't another day, another without day. actually bringing, without ha without really trying to bring it back, and that, and with that really not much of a future to look forward to. That is pretty sad when you put it in that context. Huh. In a way, I feel sorry for Susie. She's so locked in trying to relive the past that... She's unable to see the future in front of her. Wow. This, this is the character really we hate, right? <laughs> yeah, I know, right? I like, just, I hated I her just, so much, but... I seriously just give... Wow. I didn't mean, I didn't mean to make her super mad, but I guess in a way... Oh, back off! I don't know, I mean, I didn't really think about it until just now. Like, wow. I feel sorry for Susie in a way. Like... When you really dig down deep and think about it, that's really tragic. Also, I'm really sorry, Bendy. I don't mean to do this, but it's part of the tasks. I know. Besides, it doesn't bother me. They've made pl they've made plenty. Catching a few just to piss off the big demon. Do it. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, then again, hopefully we don't have another one of those glitches where like he's just stuck in place. <laughs> I remember that was really weird. <laughs> Just watching him kind of saunter around. I kind of forgot about that, honestly. Yeah. Oh, but still. That recording was fun. Uh, 
I can't wait for chapter five when we bring everyone back. That's gonna be so great to have everyone back for the finale. The finale. Oh yep. Gosh, that's gonna be the finale. It's kind of sad in a way, you know? It's all coming to an end. You're having to go pretty far back just to get all of them, aren't you? Well, I mean, that's the objective. It said go through into Heavenly Toys and destroy the cutouts. So that's what I'm doing. I don't remember, I don't remember going back this far, but then again... I, I do, because I remember we had to go back here for one for a couple of these cutouts. Also, I recall this part because we were talking about a certain someone in a certain outfit. No, 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 no. <laughs> Nope! What are you talking about? I have no idea what you're saying. I don't know what you're talking about, Bendy. I mean, it certainly seems like you're really worried about something there. I don't know what you're talking about. We're playing a game, right? Yeah, Maybe I know. you got all of them? Uh, I think I gotta go back a little bit to find the last Hi. one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Bendy. I had to. It was too good of a joke to pass up. Oh, Kala, I've got something to tell you. <laughs> Don't you spoil this for me, Bendy. Only if you let that outfit die. I'll let it die, but don't you spoil this for me. Good. Then it's going to be a secret. Good. Anyways, I feel like I missed one. Wait, what? No! Uh oh! No! 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 I thought this looked darker. No! 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 Come on! Where's the hiding spot? Where's the hiding spot? Come on! There's gotta be one. There's gotta be one. There's gotta be one. Where the heck? Crud, he's catching up. He's catching up. He's catching up. I don't see one. They were freaking out, like tightening up. Oh, there's one. It's all the way back there, but there is one. Come on, come on, come on! And in! Whew! That was way too close! Okay, um, was not expecting that to happen! Oh boy! Well, that made my heart race a little bit! What about you? I legit I think my heart just tightened up and shriveled into a raisin. Yeah, mine too a little bit. Uh, but hopefully he goes away and we can just go on our merry way. Uh, remastered or standard, this is still freaky. Alright. Oh, his ink trail is still there, so he's not gone yet. I'm just kind of waiting for it to disappear so I can move forward. I think I'm good. I think. You are think. Alright, I'm gonna move on. Take it nice and slow. Just in case. Yeah, no, his trail is still there, so maybe if I approach it at the right speed, I can make it so that when he disappears. Oh! Nope! Nope! nope that was nope. a mistake! That was a mistake! Should have just waited! Nope! Back into the hiding hole! Alright, in we go! Oh boy. Well, I it's just gotta wait it out at this point. Yeah, he is. Which gives me an idea. I'm gonna take a risk here, but I'm gonna, try. I'm gonna try something. Ha! <laughs> can't get out the barricade, God bless him! I'm gonna take a risk! You're gonna die! You're gonna die! You're gonna die! Well, I'm doing good so far! Yeah, so far! Alright, just gotta keep moving, right? Just gotta move, gotta move, gotta move! You're gonna die. Probably, but worth it. It was worth taking a risk. I told you, he catches up pretty quickly. Yeah, I feel like I could try to outrun him and get to the next hidey hole, but unfortunately, was not the case. I told you, he get he catches up. I he know, didn't but to I, me, damn it. I had to try. At the very least, it put us far farther forward, so that's a plus. Yes, but still. I listen. swear I missed one. Wait a minute. I remember the one I missed. 
It was right here. Ha! <laughs> Again, the simplest things are stumping us today. <sighs> Goodbye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just bring up the elevator and let's get to the next floor. I already got caught by him. And, you know, even though he's a penalty for getting caught, it honestly didn't... <laughs> yeah, did you not see him coming? And I did. Like, as soon as the door closed, he was right there. Just like... Bah! Oh, jeez. I admit, that's funny. The fact he just showed up right there as we were finishing is hilarious. You're finding a lot of things hilarious today, aren't you? Well, I mean, now that I've played through it, it doesn't affect me as much. Eh, fair point. Like right. I said, replayability doesn't exactly exist in this game, sadly. True. Alright. Now is the gauntlet that I've been worrying about. You are not my angel! Can I kill you first? Yeah, no, we're gonna kill her first. All right, come on, lurkers. I'm ready for you. Bring it on. Come here. And down you go. You know, it'd be nice to have a different weapon, but apparently the angel's not nice enough to do that. No. Ugh, I always hated this one. He's so creepy looking. Not to mention he has that extendable arm that is such BS. Anne, I see that face. What are you planning? And it's nothing. Don't worry about me. Why do I get the feeling Kaiser and the others have to worry about next Tuesday's session? I don't think. Uh, I don't think it has to be Tuesday. Oh, then what is it? She's not telling me, and she left. Uh, okay. Well, that was confusing. Don't you? Unless she has an idea for an Elder's abomination of a character. Who knows? I don't know. We don't know what goes on in her mind. True, true. Oh, right. There's one last task we had to take care of. Oh, I remember this The projectionist. Sending you a little Light to the hands of sorrow, down by the darkest bed. Walk, it's the fear of silence, I am the one calling your name. Yeah, no, this is gonna melt. I forgot. It's a little hard to get a hold of. Better luck next time. Ah, well, I know it's because I died. I know you have to do this, like, perfectly to get the Tommy gun. But in all honesty, it ain't worth it in my opinion. Now then. Down to the depths. Floor 14. Really gotta go down for this one. Now I remember this part was actually really freaky because of all the monsters in this game, before Piedmont, uh, the projectionist was honestly the freakiest in my opinion. Because... Because he had the visage of a man, but with the head of a projector. That's legitimately unsettling. Well, he wouldn't be skulking in the light, you know, I mean, that's a bit of a contradictory statement. Yeah. Alright, now I gotta be careful, because the moment he sees you, much like with Joey Drew, you gotta run. Run, run, gonna... run as fast as you can, you can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man! What? Isn't that how the old rhyme goes? Yeah, but I was trying to think of a clever way to make it work in the turn in context of this game, but I could up with nothing. It happens! Nope. 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 I also remember he can't go upstairs, so this is pretty much a death trap for him. Yeah, nope. He can't do nothing, bless his little cotton socks. Or ink socks, I guess. If only there was another way to get down there except for this one staircase. Because seriously, this just leads upward. Gotta wait for him to pass 
which honestly takes a bit because he moves slower than a slug. Very slowly he saunters through the ink, very slowly illuminating the place. Could you move a little faster there, buddy? Eh, better than nothing, I suppose. Down we go! Now, I didn't have too much trouble with this the first time, but that could quickly change. So instead of going to the left, let's go to the right. Still there, Bendy? Oh, boy! I'm here. Oh, and... nope, we're caught. We are so caught. Nope, ain't no way we're getting past this. You know, yep, if... we're dead. We're dead. Unless... Nope, we're dead. Nope, back off! Oh, you can hit him? Stunt? Oh. You can stun him! That's a new feature! Holy heck! Although that might cause a lot of problems for people with epilepsy. So I'm gonna try not to look at him and find a hidey hole to get out of this situation! And, and nope. Still, good. the fact that's, that you can actually hit him. Uh-huh, that's good information to know. It's just a shame that we found out a bit too late. All right, now where's the... Oh, statue's literally right in the ink. Gotta be really careful. All right, I might have driven... Nope. Sir, every time I see flickering lights, I worry, because it might be the projectionist. Oh, nothing here. To be fair, isn't the projectionist kind of, um, like, stronger than these? True. Now, we gotta find five hearts. Now, where those are, I honestly don't remember. But, we just gotta be careful, and we'll be able to find them. Alright, there's one. It, whoa! That already? Seriously? Crud, you don't give a break, do ya? Nope. Don't you touch me! Nope, going in the hidey hole. Leave me alone! I love he knows you're in there, and yet as soon as you get into this thing, it's like, oh, where to go? Uh, whatever. Alright. Should be okay. I'm gonna start moving now. Alright, so we got one heart, so four more to go. And since he's far away, we don't have to worry about him for a little bit, so we can go at this at a calm pace. No, no heart there. So why do you think she needs hearts? Like, is it just so she can stuff them into her own chest or something? I honestly don't know. Well, whatever the reason, it's morbid as all get out. Seriously, she's literally looting a corpse. Un... On what? Whoa! Nope! Oh, nope! Okay. Nope! 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 Go oh, away! Like, like, are these hearts actually still beating? Because if that's the case, then there might be something to do with the fact of, like, yeah. But don't really have time to worry about that now, given the current situation. Yeah! 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 yeah. Uh, so does this mean we need to collect them all over again, or do we keep the four that we already have? You wanna, you wanna risk it and press the, press the pause button? Uh, might as well. Oh no, we actually have them. God darn it, pause! Extra thick! So, um, something weird happened? Uh, to explain, we had to restart the game. And we had to backtrack because we didn't save. And we were, you know, doing this, and we ran into Norman, and we fought him, and apparently killed him! Like, we killed Norman! We didn't mean to, it just kind of happened! Um, I mean, it makes this part easier, but... Wow, I was not expecting that to happen, in all honesty. Uh, Bendy? Your thoughts? I didn't know you could kill him. I like, didn't either. All of a sudden, like, I was wailing on him. I heard a screech, and then... Oh, dear. I'm not gonna lie. That legitimately shocked us. Both in and out of character. Like, Ann and Kaiser freaked. Yeah, because we weren't expecting him to just suddenly up and die. I didn't think you actually could. It, uh, oh I know, gosh. it was weird. So yeah, no, all of us are a little shocked at the moment. I think shocked is an understatement. <laughs> yeah, um, 
I guess that's kind of a new thing. But, um, yeah, apparently, and I'll tell you guys this, if you decide to play Chapter 3's remaster, if you start hitting him, you can actually stun him. If you keep hitting him enough, you can actually take him down. That is a thing you can do. Take that knowledge, use it as you wish. Because in all honesty, I'm kind of shocked. As am I. <laughs> Anyways, we have three hearts, so we just need two more, I think. Holy moly, I wasn't expecting that to happen. Well, you learn something new every day. Yeah, no kidding. Just... Whoa! That's ridiculous that that actually happened. Anyways... It is a little tough to go through here without a lot of light. Especially now that, you know, you don't have Norman creeping up on you. Seriously, what the hell? I think we're going to be in shock for a little while. Yeah, just a bit. Just, just, just a bit. That was completely unexpected. Oh, my word. Anyways, um, yeah, collecting hearts for Susie Campbell. Um, it's gross, it's disgusting, and it's weird you, they actually look like human hearts instead of like, you know, cartoon hearts, you know. It makes it a little bit creepier. I'm sorry, I really can't think of anything else to say at this point. We killed him! Like, straight up, just BAM! Right in the face! I don't even what are we going to name this episode then? <laughs> um, I guess the achievement we got, Norman's Fate, because that's kind of the only thing I can think of that would properly fit this. Fair enough. So, wait, where's the fifth heart? We've checked everywhere we can go. This is a maze we're talking about. True, might have missed something. I'll check again. Lap two. Unless... No. Do we have to take the heart from... Norman? No. But you can see, this is him. Like, this is his body. Right here. D -d Dead. Extra thick. So, yeah. Apparently, there's only four hearts in the maze, and the fifth one is right at the bloody start. How did we miss that? How did we miss that? I don't know, but let's just end this already. Like, no joke. We've been at this for 20 minutes trying to find this one heart. We have explored every possible nook and cranny trying to figure it out. Oh, it was on. right there. <sighs> Whatever. Let's just give her the hearts. Save the freaking thing. Oh, dear Lord. This is ridiculous. Okay, remember how I said this was my least favorite chapter? This is why. Talk about turnaround. I'm ready to walk away. I'm just ready to walk away. Take a few breaths. Maybe, maybe sn smoke a cigarette or see you and just. <sighs> Ugh. I honestly, I need some moonshine after this. Yes, time to go home and time to get out of this bloody chapter. Ugh, let's go. Come on, do the big twist. I'm in the lift. Come on. Why can't I press the buttons? Why can't I why can't I press the buttons? Um uh, Hello? Uh, Alice! Did we just break the game again? Did we seriously break the lift? Um, uh, guys, we don't know what's going on anymore. Nothing's working. Uh, you know what? Bendy, can we just end it here? Sure, I'm done. <laughs> like, no joke, this has gone on long enough. And pretty much the ending is the same anyway, so there's not much else to see. 
you've pretty much seen everything that's new with this chapter, and it's not much. Basically, all the tasks got shortened, save for the last one, and you know, it looks nicer. That's pretty much it. So, with that said, now we can move on to the final chapter of this game with no issues. Hopefully. <sighs> yeah, hopefully after this episode. And with that said, thank you guys so much for watching up to this point. I know this was a long one, but there was a lot to show. And a lot of weird things happened. So if you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and a comment in the boxes below letting us know your favorite moments from this episode. Also, be sure to subscribe, ring the notification bell, and turn on all notifications so you know when we're finally finishing Bendy and the Ink Machine. Also, share this video around! This was quite a doozy, and we'd like people to see it. Also, once again, special thanks to Color Mix Studios, aka Bendy, for joining me on this rather hectic adventure. Thanks for having me come, come on board. This, this will be fun to see these again. Yep, and with that said, this is Mugman, and I'll be seeing ya. Bye-bye!